I just want to talk about the makeup first and foremost. I know it it's it, it looks stupid. But I'm gonna keep it on. Anyways, I thought I would come to you guys with a thick thrift haul. I have plenty of things to show you guys. Some fun little finds. Another thing I would like to point out is no, I did not make my bed. Yes, there is a bunch of stuff on my nightstand. I don't want to feel like I have to present myself as someone I'm not to you guys. Um, This is the real me. This, this is, is real. This is me. I'm exactly where I'm supposed to be. I'm just going to get into my bed after I'm done filming this anyway, so there's really no point in making my bed. Life is too short to make your bed. Let's go ahead and just dive right into these pieces. First things first, I got this little Adidas shirt. It's pretty cool, it's pretty trendy. I think it's a little boys, so it might not look right on me. Second thing I got is this green t-shirt with a pocket on it. I mean, it's just a green t-shirt with a pocket on it. Next, I got this great jacket. I like it, it's a fun jacket. Next, I got this cool shirt. It's a men's and it's way too big for me, so I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. It's probably super ugly, but I think it's cool. And that's all that matters. Next, I got these jeans. I still haven't decided if I'm gonna cut them or leave them how they are. I just really like the wash and their Levi's and they fit me well. And high-waisted jeans are always my go-to jean because I got a little pooch, I got a little belly and high-waisted jeans just kind of conceals that. So next I got these Champion Okay, so here's the deal. I, I thought they were like biker shorts, but now that I think about it, I think they might have just been like little boys underwear, which is kind of gross, but kind of kind of good. Um, so we'll figure that out. I have to sneeze. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I guess it's like the dust from the clothes because I haven't washed them yet. The first time I ever got bullied was in kindergarten by this girl. Basically, one of my favorite things to wear was overalls. And one day she just told me, she was like, you need to stop wearing overalls, you look like a boy. And I went home and I just decided, okay, I'm never wearing overalls again and I have not worn overalls since then. With that being said, I got these um, khaki short overalls just to test my insecurities a little bit more, make me feel a little bit worse about myself. It's fine. I got this shirt. Basically my pro thrift tip for you is if it looks like something your grandma has had or has worn, buy it 100%. Going along with the grandma theme, I got a grandma sweater because first of all, the colors, love them. Second of all, if you guys haven't caught on yet, I basically am just an off-brand Emma Chamberlain, but she has a sweater that looks a lot like this. At least I think it looks a lot like this. Um, but it was like $50 and I don't have Emma Chamberlain YouTube money. So $1.75 for that. Next, I got these striped pants. They're just flowy. They reminded me of Beetlejuice, the pants that he wears. So obviously I had to get them. Next store. First, I got this men's t-shirt and it's got smoky bear on it. I got this Harley Davidson t-shirt. It's really big, it's men's, and you can tell it was loved by like some man or woman who just loved to ride. Will I ever get a motorcycle? No. Do I have any intention of getting one? Absolutely not. And then I got this denim jacket. It fits me perfectly like how I want a denim jacket to fit. Okay, one thing that really turns me on about thrift store finds is when you can tell a shirt used to be white and now it's like this pea color says everyone looks forward to Fridays throughout the world. I think that's for that restaurant, TGIF, whatever. It's a good shirt. And then last thing I got from that store is this Pac-Man shirt. I am a whore for tie-dye, so anytime I see a good tie-dye shirt, I have to get it. So. I got these two shirts from a yard sale. A lady that was having the yard sale was so adorable. I wanted to like sit and talk to her for so long. She was so cute. But yeah, they were like her clothes. And like I said earlier, old lady clothes are my favorite clothes. So I got this the Paisley printed button up. So that's fun. And then I got this denim floral button up shirt, which is also fun. Oh my God. I just licked my lips and it's really dry and crusty. And then I went to a high fashion thrift store or something like that. It's really small and I was just like, oh, the prices are probably going to be way too expensive. And they definitely were. It just wasn't really up my alley. But it was ran by a bunch of old ladies. So I felt like I had to buy something. Let me hide my cheesecake factory bag. So from the high fashion store, believe it or not, this was actually only a dollar. I don't really know why. It's 
a black mini skirt that I will probably never wear because I don't wear skirts ever, but I bought it anyways. And I also got another skirt. <laughs> it's this really basic corduroy button down skirt that all the basic girls were wearing last season. We love being unoriginal and late on fashion trends. We've almost reached the end, so just keep pushing through. Next, I got this shirt right here. I wanna crop this, uh, just hear me out on it. I probably won't crop it for the try on. I don't know, like it might be a little ugly to be honest. It's literally the ugliest shirt I've ever seen. Okay, and then I got these pink high-waisted jeans that I'm probably gonna turn into shorts, but they were only a dollar, so that was a fun time. I got these plaid shorts because I decided to stray away from the grandma theme of things and move on to grandpa style. So I got these shorts. The last thing, the last thing of my thrift haul is this denim button up, but it's not just any denim button up, okay? It is a hand painted cow denim button up. It was painted by Elizabeth in 1992. She did an exquisite job. Like, look at the detail. I think it's cool. I don't know. I appreciate Elizabeth's art. I don't know why she felt the need to donate it because it's so cool and like, yeah. So yeah, that's it. That's all, so. I mean, I hope you enjoyed. I, all right, bye. I hate ending videos. I'm just gonna go, all right.